Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and today's gospel from the beginning of Luke chapter 18 has a parable about the necessity to pray always without becoming weary. It's the story about a dishonest judge who finally gives in to the requests of a widow who keeps pounding on his door and giving him no peace. Here's what Pope Francis said about this parable. From this parable, Jesus draws two conclusions. If the widow could manage to bend the dishonest judge with her incessant requests, how much more will God, who is the good and just Father, vindicate his elect who cry to him day and night? That is why Jesus urges us to pray and not to lose heart. We all go through times of tiredness and discouragement, especially when our prayers seem ineffective. But Jesus assures us Unlike the dishonest judge, God promptly answers his children, even though this doesn't mean he will necessarily do it when and how we would like. Prayer does not work like a magic wand. It helps us keep faith in God and to entrust ourselves to him, even when we do not understand his will. In this, Jesus himself, who prayed constantly, is our model. This is what prayer does. It transforms the desire and models it according to the will of God, whatever that may be. Because the one who prays aspires first of all to union with God, who is merciful love. The parable ends with a question. When the Son of Man comes, will he find faith on earth? And with this question, we are all warned, we must not cease to pray, even if left unanswered. It is prayer that conserves the faith. Without it, faith falters.